Hey, coffee lovers. If you're like me, you've probably had your fair share of regular coffee, but have you ever tried Turkish coffee? Today, we're breaking down the big differences between these two classic brews, and trust me, there's more to it than just the cup size. Oh, and if you're looking for the best coffee gear to brew your own cup, I've got links to my favorite products down in the description. Be sure to check those out. First up, the grind. Turkish coffee is ground super fine, almost powder-like, whereas regular coffee is usually ground to a medium or coarse texture, depending on your brewing method. That fine grind is key to Turkish coffee's bold, thick texture. Now let's talk about how they're made. Turkish coffee is brewed directly in water, often with sugar, over low heat in a special pot called a chesve. It's not filtered, so the coffee grounds actually end up in your cup. On the other hand, regular coffee, like drip or pour over, is made by filtering hot water through coffee grounds, leaving you with a cleaner, smoother drink. Another big difference? The serving size. Turkish coffee is traditionally served in small espresso sized cups. It's meant to be savored slowly, while regular coffee is usually served in larger mugs, perfect for sipping throughout the day. That brings us to the experience. Turkish coffee has a ritualistic feel. It's a social drink, often shared with friends or family after meals. It's strong, bold, and leaves a bit of sediment at the bottom of your cup. Regular coffee, on the other hand, is more of an everyday brew, perfect for that morning caffeine fix. So to sum it up, Turkish coffee has a fine grind, no filter, and a rich, thick texture. Regular coffee is filtered, has a cleaner taste, and is usually milder. Turkish coffee is served in small cups, while regular coffee tends to come in bigger mugs. Both have their charm, but it really comes down to personal preference. Are you more of a bold, intense coffee drinker? Then Turkish coffee might be your go-to. If you like a smoother, easier sip, stick with regular coffee. Either way, there's no wrong choice. Let me know in the comments which one you prefer, Turkish or regular, and why. And remember, I've linked some great coffee gear in the description, so make sure to check those out. Don't forget to subscribe for more coffee comparisons and brewing tips. See you in the next video.